Hi, this is Susan, and I'm here to do a little rolling with you. Today I have a yoga tune-up therapy ball. If you don't have one of these, you can try a tennis ball. We're going to be rolling out our glutes. We tend to carry a lot of emotions in our hips, and this is a nice stress relief as well. So I'm going to take the tune-up ball, find any kind of meaty area that you have back here, and I'll uh, lean into the wall like this. I'm going to just hold my shirt so that you can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to first start by kind of shimmying my hips from side to side. And as you're exploring right now, you might find that you come to an area that feels a little more tender. You might pause there, make sure you can breathe though. Um, but when you're rolling any part of your body, you want to make sure that it is not um, tingly or hot or kind of a nerve-related sensation. If that's the case, please back out of it. Make sure your breath is steady and smooth here and try not to hold your breath just as you wouldn't hold your breath if you were having a massage. This is like getting a deep tissue massage. Right now the tuna ball is helping to work with our fascia, which is our connective tissue right underneath our skin, and which the fascia can get sticky, bound up, dehydrated. This helps to bring new fluids and help to recirculate um, the area so that it can move more efficiently and flush out the toxins a little better. So I'm just rolling from side to side. If you find a place that you want to stop, you're just going to lean into the ball. It's called sustained compression. You might try this technique as well. Squeeze your right buttocks. The tuna ball's on the right buttocks. So I'm going to squeeze that tight and then exhale and release and relax and let my body sink in a bit further. Nice full deep breaths. Rolling from side to side. Now I'm going to move the tune-up ball down or up a little bit from where it was. Just find a new spot still on the right side and roll around. So I can roll across. I could also bend my knees and roll up and down. Sometimes we go along the grain of the muscle and sometimes we go against it. Nice full inhales and full exhales. Now to check in to see any effects of your practice from rolling out, I want you to remove the tuna ball from the right side, lean into the wall for a moment, and just notice the right buttocks and compare it to the left buttocks. They may feel exactly the same, or maybe the right side feels flatter, more open, a little more relaxed. Maybe you feel a sense of circulation happening there. And then once you've checked in, Go ahead and roll out on the other side as well. Thanks for joining me.